the artist accepted the parents' apology. The Royal Children's will team up with the Boston Children's Hospital to help improve care for sick kids. Hospital Chief Christine Kilpatrick flew to the United States to make the announcement alongside Premier Daniel Andrews. State political reporter Andrew Lund was there. Armed with dozens of koalas and kangaroos, Daniel Andrews discovered Boston kids can be tough customers. I got another stuffed animal in my bag. The Premier was visiting the Boston Children's Hospital to mark a new partnership with the Royal Children's Hospital in Melbourne. There's no doubt in medicine and in health generally today it's all about collaboration. We have you know a whole set of digital opportunities, telehealth opportunities, communications that were never available before and so crossing that great ocean is going to be much easier than in the past. The two hospitals plan to collaborate to improve safety and quality standards as well as expanding their education offering. Dedicated to improving the lives of children uh, from prevention all the way through the most complex care. Boston is a world leader in medical research. This facility has used zebrafish to unlock treatments for cancer and muscular dystrophy. The state government hopes Victoria can tap into that knowledge. There are eight important memorandums of understanding, so important deals that formalise partnership, take partnerships to the next level. The government's also announced an $80 million joint enterprise between Monash University and the University of Melbourne, designed to accelerate the development of new medicines. The partnership is expected to generate around $360 million worth of activity over the next decade, which the government says will support the development of new companies and jobs as well as increased investment and exports. We have some of the best science anywhere in the world, some of the best people who are doing great work. We need to keep more of that value chain in, in our local area. In Boston, Andrew Lund, Nine News. Lavinia is along now with the weather. Quite a bit of fog about this morning, Lavinia. There was, Pete. All suburbs were affected, but it was...